All right, thanks, Ken. Yes, we have Hillary McSpadden, and she's here to represent a property in Lyons at the Landmark Residences. And Hillary, we've Good been morning. talking about <laughs> this place for a number of years. It is a landmark. It has been there a while, but exciting things yes. have been going on in the last few years. Absolutely. 16 new residences. The developer basically purchased the air rights over the west wing of the building. And the residents are just exquisite, of course, north to south, so south-facing views, huge views all the way from Beaver Creek to Gold Peak. And, you know, we always talk about the location is you can't beat the location and the views. Oh, yeah. Well, especially with all the, um, the great things that are happening in Lions Head in the last few years, too. You've got the gondola as well as Chair 8 Children's Ski School, a lot of great restaurants. Yep. Yeah, we changed some things up in the last year because we had four two-bedrooms remaining. You can see here, this is the south-facing side looking out towards, um, you know, Lion's Head's kind of cool because it's tiered, so you're sitting up and you look over everything in Lion's Head. An incredible pool deck. So what they did is they came in and they did a major exterior facelift to the building. Brand new um, amenities uh, with ski locker, fitness, um, lobby. So they just took the building to another level. And it's nice because if you um, consider ownership, you don't have to worry about special assessments coming in yeah. the future. Okay, which oh is yeah, fantastic. that's so nice. Yeah. And um, Michelle, your other teammate was here yeah. yesterday showing us some pictures from some of the other properties. And just the finishes yes. are so impressive. Yeah, they really went over the top with ash hardwood flooring, granite counters. Um, the elegant cabinetry did, you know, self-closing drawers, just little things like that that you probably wouldn't think about. But vaulted ceilings, um, even on the fifth floor residences, you have nine and a half foot ceilings. Oh, wow. But what we did this past spring is we took one of our two bedrooms and turned it into a two plus den. Because a lot of people want a little more overflow yeah. um, and need more space and looking for that third bedroom space. So it really turned out beautifully. It's, it's newly furnished. So definitely a property to come check out. Yeah, you don't want to turn people down when they want to come visit or not have enough room. So right. it's nice to have that extra space with yeah. that den. And if you see it on the MLS as two bedroom, don't discount it because maybe it is a two bedroom plus yes. den. Yes, yeah, and it'll say a two plus den, but we have three remaining um, in just a, in the low two millions. We also have um, a, another two plus den on the far end, an end unit with ex just exquisite vaulted ceilings, beautiful. That's what Michelle was talking about yesterday. Uh, residence 519 and that's definitely worth looking at as well. Um, there's a couple other resales in the building but you know th there's not a lot of new construction out there so you know that the unique thing about Landmark is the cost of ownership is so low and compared to relative to other new construction. Well it's also nice too you have the front desk right there and I'm sure it's an easy rental you know, yeah, exactly. You put it in the rental pool, and you yeah. have someone pay for it while you're not here. Full-time front desk, concierge services. Um, it's fantastic. It's over the top, and then they have they have such an established history of rental. So if you're looking for an investment, it's really it's the way to go. And you guys are going to be there this afternoon, right? We are. We're there Wednesday through Saturday, two to five. But we can stop in any time. So just call us for an appointment or visit our website. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Well, thanks for coming in and Thank introducing you. us to a landmark. It's a historical address in Vail, but with all the new construction lately that they've done and it's ready to go you might want to take a tour this afternoon two to five they're there Wednesdays through Saturdays stop by and say hi to Hillary and the rest of the team we've got more good morning Vale coming up we're gonna let you know what you're gonna need for your head today to stay warm and to stay safe and we'll also give you weather details on this new storm coming in